Wow. Yep. That's about how I feel. I just totally broke down to Brandon. Okay. You want a blessing? Yes. Oh God. I think it's 12.30. I need my best friend today. I miss you, Miguel. I just need a hug. I'm a kill hug. I just broke down to Brandon. It gets so frustrating. When no one can tell you why you're hurting. And you start to wonder if you're going to always feel that way. I'm so angry. And frustrated. And anxiety ridden. And today I woke up. Well, last night I was hurting so bad. I had one pill left from my gallbladder surgery that I had saved that I had, should have probably got rid of, but um, it was in my bag and I took it last night for the pain and I was finally able to fall asleep about 3.30 in the morning. And Brandy got up and did the kids this morning angrily because I couldn't do it. And... He gets it. He just deserves sleep too. And he just worked his butt off last week. He had a bunch of third shifts and uh, somebody put in their two week notice at the little hospital that he works at here in town. So everybody's having to change their schedules and medical life, chronic life. So I don't want to cry anymore and I can't stop. So the x-ray, nobody's called me today. Luckily we have connections at that hospital so I was able to see the x-ray. There are no kidney stones. It looks to me like there's a blockage up right by my gallbladder surgery. Like you can see the staples and then there's this big pile of gas and then a lot of bowel. And I'm like, how can there be that much bowel inside of me when I don't eat? And they don't see any kidney stones. I mean, what the hell is going on? I just want someone to tell me, yes, there's something wrong. Here's what it is. We can do something to help you. So you're not in constant pain. <sighs> Lupus sucks. <laughs> Whatever. I'm done feeling this way. I don't want to feel like this anymore. <sighs> Breathe. Breathe. I can't breathe. <laughs> I've been crying. Okay, so what's happening today? It's now 12.30. My husband gave me a priesthood blessing. I mean, I don't... I don't there's nothing else I can do. I don't want to take any more ibuprofen. Because I can't eat. Because everything hurts. I haven't eaten normally for days. Weeks, actually. So, let's see. I've got tons of studying to do. I've got class at four. I've got two tests to take. And I woke up to a phone call today at 11.30 that I have an IEP meeting today to go over some psychological evaluation results at Ammon School for Ammon at two o'clock. This meeting was supposed to be tomorrow, but it's today. It's probably better that it's today because tomorrow Brandy works and I would be able to go get kids and be a meeting at the same time. So I don't know how I'm gonna get through the rest of today. Relying on faith. I don't know how I'm going to sit through class all night. I can do this. I can do this. I have to do this. Okay, so I just went in the kitchen and got some nasal spray so I could breathe after crying all morning. I gotta get it together. 
my life doesn't stop just because I don't feel good. I guess nobody's really does. And I can't hold the phone still. There's a moth in here. I look lovely. I don't care how I look today. Oh. I don't know why the dog's barking. 